pride of the Motor City. Love his accent. Old school combat! Ten ten, need backup now. What model are you? I'm a cop, Terminator. I am not subject to human law. Round one, fight! are in violation of the law. Round two, fight. Final round, fight! the law. Finish him. Friendship. Robocop wins. Robocop. I be whack. Ah, the memories. Machines are either a benefit or a hazard. Which am I? Were you a benefit, you wouldn't be my problem. Round one, fight.
final round, fight. Coming with me. Guns, guns, guns. The Terminator. Sonia's happy place. Ten ten, need backup now. What model are you? I'm a cop, Terminator. I am not subject to human law. Round one. Fight! Obey the law. Finish him. OCP built me to serve the public trust, protect the innocent, and uphold the law. So when I found Kano dealing arms to old Detroit's gangs, I had one duty, apprehend him. I never thought the chase would take me to a different universe, let alone end in a fight with Kano's protector, Kronika. And when Kronika went down, something unexpected happened. Her power washed over me, sweeping away the limits my designers had put on my programming. 
For the first time, I saw the depth of OCP's corruption. It wasn't just a couple of greedy executives. It was the whole damned company. OCP is making a killing playing both sides, selling to cops and criminals. When I get home, I am bringing them to justice. It will not be fast or easy. OCP has too much cash and too much firepower for me to clean things up alone. It is a good thing this will be an interagency effort. Welcome to the future of law enforcement. It was an epic accident that brought the Terminator here rather than to his own Earth's past. But it didn't take long for him to adapt. He figured that terminating Kronika and taking her hourglass gave him the best chance at achieving his mission objective. Destroying humanity so that the machines prevail. Turns out the hourglass wasn't the ultimate weapon. No matter how many times the Terminator rebooted history, the war between humans and the machines always ended the same, with their mutual destruction. He realized this war was a losing game, the only way to win was not to play. So the Terminator used the Hourglass to build a future where machines and humans don't fight. They cooperate. The Terminator knew that to preserve this future, no one else could learn about the Hourglass. The information stored in his machine mind was dangerous. It had to be eliminated. That's why the Terminator threw himself into the infinite depths of the Sea of Blood. No one would ever find him, or unlock the Hourglass's secrets. If you could ask him about it, he'd tell you he made the only logical choice. But in my book, that machine's a hero.